Hey soccer fans, this is Jose Bosch and you're watching Rising TV on Your View Arizona. We're a little over a quarter of the way through the season and so much has happened in that time. So let's take a look back at some of the best moments in 2017. We'll kick off even before the season started to when it all began. November 28th, 2016, Phoenix Rising FC is born. In a city with a huge number of soccer fans that haven't really had a professional franchise to rally behind in a big, big way, we wanted to put that, that battle cry out across the state of Arizona that this is a professional soccer franchise. The next big news of the year would be the club's first international signing, Chivas and Mexican national team legend Omar Bravo. Que vengo a seguir creciendo, eh, que vengo a crecer junto con ellos. Ellos están ávidos de, de tener fútbol, eh, de estar en, en, en las grandes ligas, como se dice. Y este es un equipo ideal para ello, ¿no? Y para ello hay que cimentar eh, buenas raíces y qué más que empezar bien, ¿no? Es un equipo que está proyectado hacia el futuro y creo que juntos podemos lograrlo. In addition to Bravo, the club also signed former English national team player Sean Wright Phillips and former Leicester City player Jordan Stewart. After a two-month preseason, it was time to kick off the 2017 regular season and welcome the club to its brand new home, the Phoenix Rising Soccer Complex. Built in just 53 days, fans and players alike were excited to have a soccer-specific stadium to call their own. And even though the club ultimately fell 2-0, spirits were still high after the match. I mean, it's obviously an amazing accomplishment uh, that's been achieved here, and uh, you know, I'm honored to be part of the team, and hopefully something special going forward. It, it was uh, obviously disappointing not to win, but it was good to be out here in front of the fans, and hopefully a lot will come back to us. The club got a second chance for a first win on April 8th, and they took advantage. Midfielder Luke Bruni scored the first two club goals ever at Phoenix Rising Soccer Complex en route to a 2-1 win over LA Galaxy 2. One thing he said to me last year, Frank, when I uh, first came here, um, was to take some more shots on, and uh, I think I had a few tonight, and I managed to get a couple of goals, so it's always good. Phoenix Rising FC wasn't done exciting its fan base following its first win at home. On April 12, the team announced the signing of international soccer icon Didier Drogba to the shock of some. Never could we have imagined someone like Didier Drogba, like one of the finest players in a Premier League club's history. Like, we could have never imagined it. And the King received a hero's welcome at Sky Harbor Airport when he arrived. And then introduced himself to a packed house on April 23rd. Soon after Drogba's arrival, the club said hello to new head coach Patrice Carterone. So happy uh, to be here today to help the club uh, to, to grow up. I will give my best really to, for us to have a fantastic result this season. Carterone made his debut on June 10th, but it's likely that few will remember that detail because that was also that night that Didier Drogba made his debut. And Drogba didn't disappoint. Holds off Bartman. Plays it to the corner. Dia with a great move to the back post and Drogba in his debut puts in the first goal of the night. It's going to be interesting now to see what the coaching staff do for Phoenix Rising as Drogba picks up the ball. He dishes off to Wright Phillips. With a great shot, Wright Phillips scores as he shoots through Siler's legs. Drogba finished with a goal and an assist on the game-winning shot in the team's 2-1 win over Whitecaps FC2. And since then, Drogba has been involved in each. Could be different. Drogba with a chance. And oh, he's in the back of the net. And every. Drogba takes it and goal since he's played. Watson. Drogba. Back to Watson. Setting it up. And it's in. It may be no coincidence that since the arrival of the club's new captain, the team is 1-0-2, its longest unbeaten streak of the season. And all of that brings us to tonight as Phoenix Rising FC prepares to take on Reno 1868 FC. And so much has happened in just this short window of the season. We can't wait for what memories will be coming as the rest of the season unfolds. Thanks for watching. I'm Jose Bosch, and enjoy the game.